Hi guys and welcome to Helpful Solutions. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to find total duration in Microsoft Project. So if you're working on a project that has this task name duration is start and finish predecessors and all those fields that remains in a project and you want to find the total duration of all the days that have been added onto your project. For example, you can see right here, I have the phase one as 23 days, phase two as 27 days, phase three as 21 and phase four as 53 days. So this is the duration. Now, if I would want to know the total duration, so it's a long project and you have a lot of days added to it and you want to see total duration of all these days in an instance for that, you have a simple way through which you can do that. So first of all, head over to the project that you've been working on and make a duration column and add the days just in front of your task name and make sure all the days are perfectly calculated according to the project. Now what you're going to do is simply click on file option and then click on options at the bottom of your screen. Now you will see this project options tab appearing at your screen. In this, you will have to click on advanced. After you click on advanced, you'll have to scroll down at the bottom of your screen and simply click on this show project summary task option. So this is display options for this project. Here we can see show project summary task is available just right here in the advanced tab under project options. And as we can see show project summary task option is available under advanced tab just under project options. So select this option, make sure this option has been enabled and simply click on OK. And after I click on OK, you will see a new tab appearing that is new business duration is start and finish. So we just added this row by doing that. This is the summary task row. And here you can see the total duration is 124 days. And if any of these days will be affected in this column, the total duration of the whole project will also be updated along with that specific day. You can see if I add this day as 20, then the total duration of this whole project will be changed accordingly. You can see this has been changed to 143 days. So that's the way to find total duration in Microsoft project. Like and subscribe if you found this video helpful.